Hi, it's Peter again with a new video to show you uh, how I have integrated the um, NFC tags with uh, AVX and EVA. So just to start out with, if you're not familiar with what NFC tags are, they are near, near field communications tags and they have a little um, chip inside them. It's actually just very flat kind of wire um, grid in them that allows information to be stored and retrieved from them. And if you have a Samsung Galaxy S3 or any other phone, um, like a Nexus uh, 7 or some others as well that have NFC um, capability in them, you can read and write these tags. So what I've got here on the left, this is a one of the Samsung tech tiles that they have that you can purchase. They're about $3 each. And you can program them as many times as you want. Um, obviously, they they save whatever you're programming them, but you can rewrite them as many times as you want. And these other tags I've got here are from antitags.com and they're kind of cool because they come in different colors and you see they've got the neat little Android icon on them. And this one is a different one that they also have. Um, and this one actually has a special backing on it so you can stick it to a metal surface and it will still read the tag when you uh, swipe your device over it. Whereas these other uh, ones here, these are just regular ones. And if you put them on a metal surface, it's not going to read them correctly so and I think this was the same price you can buy a bundle where you get this I think four of these and one of these for um, $12.99 or something like that it's kind of neat and um, Eric is the guy who's running the anti tags and he's uh, pretty good he'll send it out to you pretty quickly and um, like I said you can reprogram them as much as you want so um, what I did in AVX and EVO was I've created three different functions with respect to these tags and the first one is it can read a tag without actually executing what's on that tag. And then the next function is it can write a tag and it can write a single command to a tag or it can write multiple commands to a tag. And then the last function is it can execute whatever's on that tag. Um, so just to give you a demonstration here showing you reading a tag, this particular Samsung tag here um, I actually programmed that using the Samsung NFC application so it will open up Kindle and of course that's something that you can get AVX to do but I just want to show you reading a tag that, that's from um, an application that, that isn't AVX or EVA so just bear with me because I'm going to have to move the phone and uh, to do this so let's see here we go yes Peter read NFC tag please hold the tag to the back of your device so I can read it this tag contains the following. Okay, so you can see there it's pulled two different uh, um, messages or, or um, I guess, records off of that tag. And if you look through there, it's all encoded by the Samsung ap application there. And it's basically their way of encoding that it's going to open up the Kindle application. Now, I've got another tag here, which is also a Samsung one that I've encoded using AVX. So let's read that one and I'll show you how that comes out. Yes, Peter. Read NFC tag. Please hold the tag to the back of your device so I can. This tag is one of mine and contains the following commands. What's the time? What's the temperature? Okay, so you can see there on this particular tag, it just has two, two phrases that uh, AVX understands. And when you go and run that tag, it's basically going to, to run the what's the time and get the results for that and run the what's the temperature and get the results for that. So that's basically the difference in how they're read. Um, now if I want to encode a tag, let's start off this one I believe is empty, I haven't done anything on that. Let's say um, I want to have a tag for say activating night profile and I might put that on my bed stand or something um, on my nightstand. So let's, let's do that. Yes, Peter. Write NFC tag. Please tell me the first command of the new tag you would like to write. Activate night profile. Select the item you would like for this command. Okay, so I'll tap on that. I have added this command. Say the next command or say cancel or done. Done. Please now hold the tag to the back of your device for two seconds without moving it so I can write it. Okay, so just do that. 
I encountered a problem while creating this oh. tag. That's what happens when you move it too quickly. <laughs> Let me try it again. Yes, Peter. Write NFC tag. Please tell me the first command of the new tag you would like to write. Activate night profile. Select the item you would like for this command. No, oh, we can get it wrong. Say again. Activate night profile. Select the item you would like for this command. I have added this command. Say the next command or say cancel or done. Done. Please now hold the tag to the back of your device for two seconds without moving it so I can write it. Okay, this time I'll try to follow the instructions that I wrote. Your tag has been written. Okay, so it wrote it this time. And so if you move it away as it's writing, obviously, like any radio communications, it's going to have a problem, and I just showed you how easy it is to do it. <laughs> so I'm not trying to fudge anything in this video for you. All right, so let's read it again just to see that it has the right thing on there. Yes, Peter. Read NFC tag. Please hold the tag to the back of your device so I can read it. This tag is one of mine and contains the following commands. Activate night profile. Okay, so then the next thing you want to do is we'll actually try running it. And I'll just so you can see it runs from the background. Now you, you do have to have the screen on and you do have to have the key guard lock um, deactivated in order to have it read a tag. And there are cases, if you have, like I do, where a AVX or Eva is holding um, my key guard off for me, um, my screen lock off, that if you've just rebooted your phone, it may not read the tag when you put it on top of it, it'll just won't do anything, like it's not even working at all. All you have to do is press your home button on the phone one time, and that'll kind of fix it. And I think it's, I'm not sure exactly what's causing that, but I know it. I, I managed to debug it and find out that it, it only happens when you have AVX holding the screen lock. For some reason, um, it won't read the tag uh, the, the first time around unless you press the home button. So if I wave the phone over the tag now, it should activate the night profile, just like as if I was going to bed. And there you see it now. It's activated night profile and it's active. So that's basically how it works. And again, you could put um, any command on there and um, or any set of commands on there. So for example, you could have a tag in your car that activates the car profile or um, opens up your music player or you could have a, a tag on there that um, checks what your agenda is for the day or um, you could have a tag on your um, refrigerator that cleared your shopping list and another group of tags there, one for all the different items that you buy on a regular basis and you could just wave it past the ones that you needed to get and that would add things to your shopping list so you can do all sorts of things and of course when you combine uh, AVX and EVA with um, with Tasker and the different things that you can do with Tasker and then combine this functionality it's almost unlimited in, in what you can get this to do so it's kind of neat having these tags and um, I'm sure people will think of different ways to use them whatever's convenient for them. Um, anyway, I hope you have some fun with it and uh, let me know if you have any issues and uh, I'll try and sort them out for you. Alright, thanks for watching.